Out through the cottage door and skip across the yard. When the boy with his head full of dragons breathing hard. All along the village street and down beyond the inn. At last his chance had come for real adventure to begin. Across the yard, when the boy with his head full of dragons breathing hard, all along the village street and down beyond the inn, at last his chance had come for real adventure to begin. Up across the hillside, on crisp and frosty white, down the winding woodland path, the boy ran swiftly through. There's a fiery dragon's air. What adventure, what excitement Feels like magic in the air Now at last he'll know the answers To a plethora of puzzles Does a dragon save his grace and such Before he chews and castles? Does he use a table napkin or a knife and fork and spoon? Does he wash his claws and whiskers carefully When he dies at noon? When he tries to eat a nice Does his fiery breathing melt? Chopping ice and cream and send it trickling down his scaly pelt. If he sniffs a bunch of flowers Does he make the blossoms droop? Does he singe his hair and whiskers when he blows up on his soup? By the time the boy had reached the highest point among the hills, he was dreaming all of dragons and their instant and of grills. Do they kill before they grill or do they like to hear the screams of the gently roasting victims skipping right up on their scenes? And in case you all are thinking that this subject's done to death, well, don't worry, we shall stop now, cause we've all run out of breath. And sure enough, just outside a small but comfortable cave in the hillside, a dragon lay stretched out, purring contentedly. The boy approached, rather nervously. Good evening, dragon. Good evening, good evening, good evening. Can you think of a rhyme for moon? Splendid, splendid, splendid. I've tried baboon, pontoon, and macaroon. But they all lack something. I'm a poet, you see. Would you like to hear one of my early efforts? Half <laughs> little dragon through your little baby nostrils. Half my little scaly one and light papa cigar. Snort, little fellow, with your little me. Out through the cottage door and skip across the yard. When the boy with his head full of dragons breathing hard. Up along the village street and down beyond the inn. At last his 